Greetings people of the internet, it is I, Knuckles Productions 360, and today I'm taking a look at another Jack specific Sonic figure. Today we are taking a look at Neo Metal Sonic, and oh my god guys, I am shaking with excitement. I literally found out about this figure just today, and I ended up walking into a place called Toys and Tuck, which is all over the UK, and I managed to find this guy. Um, there was only two in there, so I got this guy right here, and yeah, so here he is in the box. You can see all around, this is official, as said by Jax. Um, he also comes with a lightning bolt, which is a really cool, awesome idea for accessory. I think this is supposed to be a nod to his transformation in Sonic Heroes. So on the back, it says all of different figures in the different ways and the articulations. He has 14 points of articulation such as the head movement, which I was quite concerned with because obviously he's got the uh, the spikes there. You can see the massive kind of starfish head, but it seems you can actually move that, so I can't wait to look at that. He also has movement in the arms as well and the legs. And then here are the other figures to collect in the next wave, well, in this wave being Classic Sonic with a new expression, a re-release of Rouge and Silver. And then, of course, up here it says a little bit about Neo Metal Sonic, such as an enhanced shape-shifting form of Metal Sonic, whose goal was to conquer the world. Well, yeah, they did succeed. And yeah, so everything's all here. So let's stop yapping and actually take a look at this awesome figure. Okay, here we go. I don't know if this will uh, change everything, but I'm opening it up. Neo Metal Sonic. Oh god. There we go. So he does have a couple of like tight zits things. So I'm just gonna get my pair of uh, scissors here. So let's see. Can we can we cut around it? I don't want to damage the, the figure. Hang on. There we go. And there's even one holding his stomach in place. So I'll see if I can. Uh... So it's really cool. So this guy comes with like a almost like a stand base. I mean, that's cool. Like that's how he is in the packaging. So I think yeah. So. There we go. That should be him. Oh my god, he's out of the packaging. Let me just. Uh. Okay. So here is Neo Metal Sonic. And oh my god, first things first, I think we should talk about the sculpt for this guy. He looks amazing. Um, one thing that I've just noticed, he has a. Uh, wrist joint. Kind of uh, gives me reminiscent of the Jazzwares figures. Um, but for other articulation, you can move his wrist up. Um, and yeah, you can turn these. I was a bit surprised. I don't think you can't turn the... Oh, yeah, you can. You can. I'm surprised about that. So you can turn the palm of his wrists. Yeah, his hands do work really well. I think they really nailed that. The uh, arm piece do move, so you can have like different poses, like he's a uh, getting ready for a fight. Um, head, you can turn it a bit, but it's kind of like with Infinite. Uh, you can't really move it too much, but yeah. Um, the fabric here, this is all plastic, so unfortunately I feel like this guy's gonna have some like moving problems. But yeah, besides that, you can move this up and down. His feet move, so you can kind of have him almost like he's flying in a kind of cool way. And yeah, honestly, he looks awesome like this. And I think the paint job and quality control on this guy is brilliant. I haven't had any problems with him um, as I've just gotten out of the box, but here's on the back. He just looks awesome. Oh my God, I literally can't believe this guy actually exists. But yeah, he looks awesome. Yeah, he can move all the way around, so a little bit kind of creepy in a way, but yeah. That is awesome. 
and of course his accessory is this little lightning bolt which he can hold in his hand I believe like that um I think this is supposed to be the comic you know the bit in the um uh the open the um near the kind of end of the game where he fires out lightning from his hand and then transforms into metal overlord which is pretty awesome so i like this guy he looks amazing so yeah he's got his lightning bolt firing out so i suppose you could do it in like a different way like he's firing out let's see can we do it the other way it seems this is the only way you can hold it in is this way yeah i think this guy looks awesome okay okay so now it's time for the moment you've all been waiting for scaling here he is with my sonic he's apologized for the dust this guy's been on my collection for a little bit and yeah honestly i think this does look very good i will say the head is a bit smaller compared to sonic um i feel like it should be a bit bigger the head for uh neo but i can kind of understand why they made a smaller version of his head i mean the head's a little small but you know it's uh it's still good i mean he's still he got that height still and honestly i love him he's brilliant so yeah there's sonic and then of course here's tails i think he scales pretty well with tails all things considered um so you can just kind of like zack him out in a different kind of cool vibe and then here he is of course with shadow i mean i have to include shadow because it's the year of shadow so there he is and then here he is with dr eggman um pretty good actually scaling wise um i would love for them to do a two i bet they will do a 2.5 inch neo metal sonic figure i bet they will i mean they gotta do one eventually but yeah here he is and then for all time's sake here he is compared with a metal sonic that i recently got the more metallic version which i'll be using in my sonic stop motion series sonic overdrive and you can definitely see the height differences with the characters so yeah awesome and yeah and of course just one last thing to show before ending the uh the video this guy he is my terribly horribly made homemade neo metal sonic and just comparing jack specifics to mine yeah i'm quite surprised but hey this guy is better the one this guy right overall i highly recommend this guy um, if you can find him anywhere, just go for it. Buy him instantly. He is an incredible figure to get. Just, I think this guy is, I mean, now when you think about it, guys, we have the entirety of Sonic Heroes cast. We have all the characters in Sonic Heroes. In fact, I've got something cool to show all of you right here. So I'll be showing it right now. Ladies and gentlemen, here is the completed Sonic Heroes teams. Team Rose, Team Heroes, Team Chaotix, Team Dark, and of course, we finally have Neo Metal Sonic. The entire main cast of characters is all complete. Oh my god, this is awesome. I love this. So thank you guys so much for watching, make sure to subscribe to my channel if you haven't already, and yeah, I will see you guys in the next video. Take care guys.